Oh, it was a moment I, I yeah, what can I say? I, I didn't see it until now. Uh, to be honest, I didn't see the pictures and television. Um, yeah, it's a big shadow on the game, to be honest. So it's not, um, usually when you tell me before the game we will win 4-0 and um, I thought I will feel different. Yeah, and, um, but now, yeah, we can talk about the game and um, this situation we have to wait for final assessment. Um, it's absolutely, absolutely too early, but um, when I came in, everybody was like this and thought, and everybody who saw the picture said something about maybe it's broken. and I, um, It's not. Yeah, so it's not. Um, I, I went to, to Devok in the medical room and I, I saw him smiling and um, it's not um, no, it's uh, the the ankle is twisted, so uh, we have to to wait. Well, I said what happens to the ligaments. That's how it is, um, and yeah, I can't say more. The performance itself was pretty complete. I would imagine you think. Yeah. Sorry. Complete performance. Oh no, uh, yeah, no. First half. Um, First half it was a derby, so it was uh, a little bit too uh, wild for a normal football game, but um, yeah, <laughs> it's a derby, so you have to accept things like this, and it's not about, um, I don't know, passing game or things like that, but, but we had the moments and um, where, we, where we could have, where we, where we passed and we could have better. Um, um, could have done better, and um, so we lost a little bit of patience in the wrong moment. So when we we we, we knew about the, the the defending style and um, how we how we how we want to have the formation in, in our offensive, it's pretty offensive. Only one one six in with with Luke, high fullback. So it was, uh, but you can't if you have a formation like this, you can't take the risk. You you need to play the right pass and not the pass you want. And well, that, we forced a few things uh, a little bit too early. So when you have then the movements, we had the movements. It was okay, but you don't. It's not allowed to use all these movements, especially not behind the line. And that's what we tried a little bit too often. That's what we told the boys in the half time. And um, but of course the two goals um, in the perfect moment, I would say. Um, and then second half. What can I say about second half? So it changed completely with um, the red card, and it changed completely with, um, of course, then the next change when when when, when Stones uh, had to come off. Yeah, that's um, that was really not easy for 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 Everton. We had a good moment. That's how it is. And we played football. We created chances. We could have scored much more. Goalkeeper or whatever. Um, uh, yeah, had a finger or foot or whatever between us and the neck and another goal. So it. Um, but that was of course good. But it, to be honest, I could sit here maybe and say it was really difficult. But second half wasn't. It's like it is, and um, but it was really difficult then for Everton uh, because uh, injuries, red card, good opponent. It's not too too easy then, and um, we 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 did well, yeah. And that's what I said. Usually after four nil, um, I I don't know how to keep my smile out of my face, but uh, today it's pretty easy <laughs> to be honest. So and now. It's like it is. We have to. We have to take it. It's. Um, we have to to see what what happened. And um, in three days, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. yes, in three days uh, we have the next um, a real battle. I saw them yesterday in Newcastle. Um, played very physical, I would say. And um, so it was a little bit like a derby. I know it's no derby, but it, it, it looked like. And so they can fight for the league. So we have to respect this, and um, we have to see who we can who we can bring. The last 20 minutes were not too intensive in this game today, maybe 30 minutes, and um, so no. we'll see tomorrow. Good for us, good result, clean sheet, four goals. So that's good to all the other teams in the table. Um, above us, uh, they won two, right? Manchester won, West Ham won. Yeah, so nothing happened, <laughs> um, but that's not. That we can't. We can't change this. We can change it. We have to. We have to win as often as possible, and then we have to look what what happens on uh, on other. We don't look there, but after the game, I think it's allowed, um, and yeah, we have to carry on. That's what we do. Tony, yeah, when you team the four and the weapon and the team that 
see them passing about the crowd, the cheering, and everything down to ten men. Does any part of you at that point feel any sympathy for Roberto, or is it the, the local rivalry means that you just enjoy it? I think even for for the, for the crowd it was not too easy. Of course, they enjoyed the game, but it was not that it, it, it was then no real fight anymore. So it was, um, um, yeah, it was. Um, oh. Yeah, they enjoyed the game. They they had they had fun. And, um, Phil could try three times, and the fourth time was in. Um, um, Daniel had a few more, and uh, um, maybe they enjoyed the situation when Adam and. Rob, um, Alberto and Phil had a little bit fun on the on the sideline and gave the ball to to Luke, <laughs> um, who destroyed this wonderful moment. And um, so that's how it is. But it's not that's not usual. Uh, I'm, I'm sure there, there there have been a lot of more intensive derbies for sure, and had a, there will be a lot of more a um, lot more um, intensive derbies. So that's how it is. That's not what happened today. It's not really normal. But they are a bit ten with ten man today. In this moment, after two 0 close to the half time, it's not that you sit in a dressing room and think, "Yeah, we can, we will, we will." Uh, not always. We had a few days ago series like this, but the game was different. It was really different. We had we had good chances in the first half against Dortmund, so we knew we had changed a few things, and we will have uh, again a few chances. I don't think Everton had really a lot of chances in the first half, so. Um, yeah, we had to we had to stay concentrated. We had to to play a little bit better, a little bit more patient in f different in, in, in different moments, and that's what we did. And so we deserved to win, and we deserved the result. Everything is okay, um, apart from Devok. Do you think your team starting to get that consistency that you've been asking for over the last few? Years? You see, cons consistency. Um, what's consistency? I, I know what consistency is, by the way. But um, you know, how can you get it? So you need. Um, we had. Still, I think the most games in Europe. Um, so, with a lot of injuries, you need you need to have a little bit of luck with injuries. And and today, um, in a situation, yeah, maybe we could have had a little bit more luck, but if we hadn't, and, and um, so they got a red card, that doesn't help us. To be honest, uh, we lost a player in this moment. And so, consistency is about having players ready for the the the, the, the next. For the actual game, and um, if you look a little bit back, I know it's for everybody. If you watch now back and you say, "Okay, it's only 1.8 or 1.9 um, points per game, or something like this," yeah, you can judge like this if you want. But if you see our situation with the number of games, with the difficulty, uh, think of we would have been still in the in the FA Cup. It would be really interesting how they would do this. I I, I can't see a day where we could play. Uh, it's in June or something. So and that's. Um, that was our situation. In consistency, now we are longer together. We work together. We could, we could, um, meanwhile, do a lot of things. Not like you usually do in one or two, three, four weeks. We need six and a half months. But um, that was our situation. We always um, so positive. We always knew about the, the difficulties of the situation. And now we are here with 54 points or something. That's not too bad. Still 15. Uh, to get or not, we will see. All the games are difficult with the specific challenge, European League. So that, that that's how it is, and um, that's our situation. And consistency comes with working together. And I told a colleague a few a few minutes ago. I know in football, the last thing everybody want to do is waiting for something, but it's the only way. I know. Sorry, to not to wait, but to work for, and that's um, that's what we did. And now you saw it. We we, we had um, in each game a Stoke, different formation, Bournemouth, Dortmund today, different formations. But you always see a few parts really of 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 our style of play. And then we are not only a pressing and counter pressing team. We can we are a possession team um, too. And that's that's a challenge to bring it all together and be in the right position. We we work still on it. It will not finish be finished in the, uh, the la after the last game of the season, but um, yeah. So we need players. Yeah, we need really we need the players. So they they have to do the work, and um, yeah, hopefully, um, yeah, we will have enough for the last few games. Final question, Mike. Yeah, yeah I can talk about players and did the work. Uh, James Milner never <laughs> stopped from first whistle to the till, till he took him off and created the first two goals and. and had an incredible night for you. Yeah, good boy. To be honest, um, yeah. 
And if you ask him tomorrow morning, he say, "Yeah, I can train if you want." So that's um, that's um, nah, he's a good player. What, Happy. what does he bring? Yeah, spirit. He's a nice guy um, and um, spirit uh, uh, next to the pitch and um, on the pitch, of course. But yeah, I, I really, with all my, with all respect, I could, if you want, speak one and a half hour about Millie. But there are, uh, uh, but there are a lot of other things to say there. But maybe if you see um, how Adam Lalana always starts our our pressing moments, even and uh, even Roberto Firmino, and if you only took him off because he's uh, he had this break of an injury and he needs time to play, but not too much and things like this. So that's uh, always to to have this. But even they losing the ball, getting back, not not in a world class moment. To work for it, and then it will come back, and things like this. So that's that's how it is. They are all. We have only really good players. There's no player in the squad where I think, oh, why is he here? There's really, really a, a good team. But the problem is, a few other teams in the Premier League are not too bad too, <laughs> and so you can lose each game. But meanwhile, it looks like we can win a few, and that's nice.